What's up guys, Mr. Reverts here, and I first want to apologize for not really posting any videos lately. I have been feeling very unmotivated to post content or even play IW, and also my birthday was a few days ago, and I just wanted to, I guess, kind of relax from the internet a bit and, uh, you know, just take it easy, but like I said, I really haven't been feeling motivated to play IW that much, and I really thought that the Days of Summer event would have really increased my spirits to hop on and play, and uh, maybe my friends would have liked to play as well with me, but it kind of didn't do much for me because it really wasn't anything that special to be honest and I want to give credit to the title days of bummer I think that's pretty funny I did see x-rays and hollow point upload a video talking about their days of summer event for black ops 3 and they're pretty much saying the same thing in their video but infinite warfare is the current call of duty title and you think that there'd be more support and better giveaways for their summer event and I really do hate to complain about free stuff but I mean dang this summer event really was pretty boring besides the quad XP week that was some of the most fun that I've ever had playing if warfare to be honest and like I said I really do hate to complain about free stuff, but I mean most of the free drops that were in this summer event were just simply camos. I mean I did like the free keys though, that was pretty nice, but I was hoping for just a little bit more in the giveaways, like maybe a free epic supply jet pack, something like that. But uh, I think that some of the stuff Infinity War did for the summer event could have been done a lot better. For example, changing up Tourista. Infinity War didn't do anything with that map, they pretty much just gave it out for free for everyone. I was hoping that maybe they could have changed it into a summer theme map like Genesis does for uh, the Christmas event for Infinite Warfare, but I don't know. I just feel that this summer event was definitely a big letdown. I did have a lot of hype going into this, but I don't know. Throughout the whole weeks that they had the summer event, it really wasn't all that fun. I think it was a big letdown. I mean, it definitely was better than Black Ops 3. Like, Black Ops 3, they really didn't do much for that game at all, so I do feel bad for those players that still play that game because you guys really didn't get much, but for Infinite Warfare, it really wasn't all that much better, uh, but yeah, MWR did have have a, a little bit better content than both those games combined and I do feel that there was a lot of unnecessary content for the days of summer event like calling cards for example emblems accessories there was a ton of camos too and all that stuff really isn't worth it in my honest opinion and it really does dilute the supply job system so that's just how I feel and also for the last day they gave out salvage like that is the last gift for the event I feel they should have done something a lot better maybe like a good weapon or something like that and also for this week they are doing a roundup hack for the days of summer Basically, if you buy this hack, you can get all the stuff that were uh, that were in the supply jumps, like all the weapons and camos, accessories, all that kind of good stuff is going to be in the hack. But it, it costs 45 keys, like that is a lot. And I've seen a lot of people pull just the camos and the accessories. None of them have really been getting the weapons that were for the days of summer event. So, like I said, I just feel that this summer event was a huge bummer, a huge letdown. But I want you guys to tell me your thoughts about this in the comment section down below. Also, drop a like if you guys did enjoy the video. And thanks so much for watching. I'm a very severe rest of the day. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.